name is Kim Rackley. I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Um, I'm actually from Georgia, so I'm a little misplaced here in the city way up north, but we're doing okay. <laughs> um, I'm sitting out here on my patio and my kids are in the back, so if it gets a little loud, I'm sorry. Um, I'm on day 21 of the Jason Pearson diet and I've lost 15 and a half pounds in 21 days which is absolutely insane for me. Here's why. First, um, a little backstory, really briefly. My husband had a brain tumor um, removed about three years ago, and then he had a stroke after that, which caused him to be disabled and very weak on one side. Um, he's doing much better now, but for about a year, I was his sole caretaker. Um, I also have three kids. At the time I had two and um, my oldest has some learning disabilities. She has an auditory problem. So I homeschool both of them um, really just to help her a lot. I used to be a teacher. Um, and then um, about a year after the brain tumor and the stroke, um, we had a series of miscarriages in one year. Two miscarriages back to back and then I had a 32 week stillbirth after that as well and um, that caused a lot of stress on my body and I wasn't able to take care of myself at all um, because I was taking care of everyone else and and it kind of needed to be in that season I really did need to take care of everyone else um, but because of that trauma to my body and the the effects of being pregnant for 12 months at a time um, really took its toll on me and with the grieving process I just started putting on a lot of weight. Um, I tried several things to get the weight off, um, especially this last year. Is my um, We did have another son, um, he's two now and I was getting to the point where I could like sleep at night a little better and everything so I was ready to take care of myself and I tried a couple of different things to lose the weight. I just tried eating healthy for three months and I joined this accountability group on Facebook and they were really great, um, but I actually had to pay money in every time I gained weight, and I thought that would really help me, but d despite my best efforts, I was kind of a yo-yo dieter. Like, I would um, I would do really well, and I would lose three pounds in a week, and that was amazing, and then the next week, I would gain two. So even though I was still at a net loss, I still had to pay money in. And then the next week, I would lose a pound, and then I'd gain half a pound. I had to pay more money in. So after about three months, I was kind of like out of money. <laughs> <laughs> and I was at a net gain of plus one after three months of working really hard. So I went to see a couple of doctors just to make sure everything checked out okay and I didn't have any underlying medical issues and um, a thyroid condition showed up that had been treated but not as well as it should have been so my dosage was increased um, and a couple of other things some mildly high cholesterol but not anything to worry about just something to watch they said and um, so I went on to try something different after that. I went to trying um, going gluten-free and dairy-free and sugar-free. I thought, these are the three biggies. If I cut these out, I bet I'm gonna just drop the weight. And Jason likes to laugh at me for this, but after two weeks, I pulled the scale out again and weighed myself, and I gained five pounds. Um, five pounds gain after doing that for two weeks. And that's when I just kind of lost it. <laughs> um, I was like, you know what? I do know a lot about food. I cook a lot for a lot of people. I've catered a lot of events. I know a lot about nutrition, but I don't know a lot about how nutrition works for my body and I need some help. So um, I talked to my husband. He thought it was a great idea. And he said, you know what? You just need to do it. This is your Mother's Day gift go talk to this guy and we'll see what we can do. So I started um, 21 days ago and now I'm down 15 and a half pounds and it's still going down. Not just the weight loss has made me super excited. There's been some other things that I've struggled with my whole life that I didn't realize were attributed to poor eating habits. Um, for instance, this is kind of embarrassing, but um, I had dandruff like my whole life. My mom has it too, my dad, my grandparents. I just thought it was hereditary, but like in 21 days, my dandruff's totally gone. Like that's really 
awesome. Like, look, I'm wearing a black shirt, y'all. I never wear black shirts. And my hair is down. It's like always up because that would hide it more. So like, I love my hair, but I could never wear it down in public because I was afraid of white flakes. And um, yeah, so I'm just, I'm really excited about that. Um, my nails are really strong. Um, they're getting longer. This is not long, I know for a lot of you, but for me, this is really great. My nails would always break. I play the piano. Um, so my nails are always weak from that, but I got a manicure the other day because my nails were doing really great. My clothes fit so much better. Um, I was kind of like going the busted can of biscuits route with my clothes, and now I am in a size that I should be in. Um, not because I bought new clothes, but because they actually fit now, and that's really exciting to me as well. Um, I feel like I got a whole new wardrobe, but I didn't spend any money. <laughs> um, and let's see, oh, oh my word, I'm so excited. In August is my anniversary, and that's, for those of you watching, that's about three months away, three or four months away. And um, like, we were really thinking that I might actually fit in my wedding gown by my anniversary. So that's kind of my goal is to like pull out my wedding gown um, for my 14th anniversary and wear it. And my husband promised me a photo shoot if we do it. So I'm really excited about that. Um, so if you're watching this video and um, you're wondering if it's worth it, if it's worth the money or if it's worth um, cooking for yourself when you're also cooking for a bunch of other people, um, if you're wondering if it's worth the time and the effort, I can say definitely it really is. And I'm so glad that I did it. Give Jason a call. You won't be sorry.